coronavirus, of course, the lead story again, altering every aspect of everyday life in America. Bringing some of our most enjoyable and important parts of life to a grinding halt. Here's just some of the few things being impacted. Disneyland is closing. Major sporting events are suspended or canceled altogether, including March Madness and UH Athletics. Kamehameha School suspending its song contest, and then the big one a couple hours ago, Merry Monarch, now canceled. It will not happen on the Big Island this year. In a statement, Mary Monarch Festival's president, Luana Cavallu, said this was such a hard decision to make, but we cannot risk the health and well-being of our community, allow participants, vendors, and the thousands of people who attend Mary Monarch every year. She went on to say in the end, we believe that keeping people healthy and safe must be the highest priority and that we all need to take on this kuleana in the face of the threat posed by the COVID-19. Kamakapili spoke with a hula halal and has more. That's right. Some consider this the Olympics to hula, the Merry Monarch Festival. We all getting the word that it's going to be canceled this year. And for many, I mean, it takes not just months, but some the entire year to prepare for this festival. And we're only a few weeks away. Now, one component to that, of course, is the many halal, the many hula schools, the dancers, and of course, the kumu hula that are spending all their time and effort putting this together. And we're here with one of those kumu hula, kumu hula chinki mohoi of Kavaili Ula. Thank you very much, Kumu, for joining us. Now, we know you're one halal that's been participating in Mary Monarch every year. First of all, how many years have you been doing Mary Monarch? Ooh, I think, well, we're celebrating our 40th anniversary this year. So we kind of counted that this is, will be our 30th time going to the Mary Monarch. And how long does it take you and the halal to prepare for this festival? As soon as we come home from the festival the, the year before, then we get together and we plan whether we're going to compete next year or not. So it takes about a year for us to um, get the wheels turning and figure out what we're going to do for the following year. Then for creating the dances, we usually start around August. So we're only, what, four or five weeks from when the festival is taking place. What is your reaction to the cancellation? Well, of course, you know, we're shocked, but I think it's for the best and the betterment of everyone because the Mary Monarch is such a worldwide event that it brings in a lot of um, people from all over the world, you know, not only Hawaii. What are your plans now that you're not going to be able to perform there with all this training? What are you expecting to do? Well, maybe now we can be more ahead for next year <laughs> and, and do the same thing next year. But while we really did, we're going to be talking about that this evening. Um, once we get to Halau and, and figure out what's going to happen and what we're going to do with our presentations that we've already created and, and trying to perfect and um, yeah, and we'll see what happens. Well, thank you very much, Kumu. Now another component in that, and of course, some halal do, Kavaili Ula this year does also have a contestant for Miss Aloha Hula. This year we have Moani. Thank you very much, Moani. And first and foremost, very sorry for, for the cancellation and you're not being able to participate and compete for Miss Aloha. But with all that being said, what is your reaction with the cancellation of the festival? It was a bit of a hard pill to swallow. Uh, being a Miss Aloha Hula contestant, I think a lot of us don't only prepare for just starting this year. I think, well, for me, it feels like a lifelong preparation. Um, you dream about this since you're a little girl, and um, to hear news like this was definitely a shock. Um, so hoping that we can just build up from here. Not everything that I learned, I would say, is lost, but it is a really big bummer. Hula is life? Hula is life, all the way. Right on. Thank you very much, Moani. Again, make sure you guys stay tuned with k 2 into News because as this pandemic evolves and more information comes with coronavirus, we'll be sure to keep you guys involved. That being said, Kamakapili reporting from the University of Hawaii. k 2 into News, working for Hawaii.